Touchdown to interception. As here's another batted pass. This is intercepted. Picked off at midfield, and Columbia gets an early takeaway from the Harvard offense. Playing time going back to his true freshman season in 2018. Deep down the left sideline for Canty. He grabs it inside the Harvard 30. Bryson Canty, a huge haul. We've seen teams take deep shots against Harvard. Jenkins and Lipman. But this pass going in the direction of Canty over the middle, open, makes the grab and tumbles down close to the 25 yard line. In the backfield, but Bell looks to pass left side. Canty caught, touchdown. Fifth touchdown grab of the season for Bryson Canty. And Columbia takes the lead at Harvard Stadium. And this is blocked. Columbia special teams of all units makes a huge play. First block field goal attempt of the year for Harvard. Saw the block kick at the end of the third quarter and another one. This is picked up by Seth Parker. Around the right side, Parker will reverse field. Still on his feet. Parker to the 50. Finally taken down at the 40. And Columbia for the second straight drive stands tall on special teams. And that decision. Here we go, third and six. Bell has time. Rolls to his right, throws downfield. He's got a man, caught for the touchdown. Luke Payton, the tight end. And Columbia is a point after from tying the game. Three receivers split to the right, one to the left. And now motion, they bring Lidman into the backfield, move Young to the right side, fake the handoff, Bell dumps it, looking for the end zone, and it's Young to get in for two, and Columbia's in front. Field goal attempt for Jonah LaPell for the lead. It's up, and it is off the post. No good. To take the lead in the final two minutes. Patrick Pasalacqua got his hand on it, and then the upright did the rest. It'll officially be 14-14 between the two, and officially an Ivy League victory for the first time in 2022 for the Columbia Lions. Al Bagnoli's Columbia squad comes into Harvard Stadium for the first time since the Clinton administration and gets a win. And that will all but take Harvard out of a race for an Ivy League championship this season.